We have a 2011 Toyota Prius with a failed water pump. So the engine was overheating by virtue of a check engine light 261B. And then there's also uh, a warning on the, on the LCD display says pull over immediately, shut the car off. Because if you just keep driving the car and the engine's overheating, you can blow a head gasket real easy. And there's the water pump right here. So there's five bolts that hold it on, one electrical connection. Electrical connection's right here. Pull that out. Going through the wheel well, that fifth bolt's much easier to get to. So make sure you got a pan underneath because taking the pump off, the coolant's going to start leaking out. common area that fails is this thing called the rotor or impeller. Right now it's not turning very easily. So this impeller can be replaced. And here's the replacement impeller. The magnetic wall, which is coated with plastic, is smooth. And usually you get a separation of the plastic right here, which rubs against the interior wall of the water pump. So we got this little rubber O-ring here. Then there's a washer, and just you could tell it's it's the impeller's hanging, and you pull it out, and there's the problem right there. You got a crack. So when I put the new impeller in place, it just snaps in, and see how easy it turns. And that's it. There's no reason to buy a whole new water pump.